Well, all right, friends, subscribers, and internet strangers. What's up? Beardy Picker here. And have I got a great secret for you. So today, we're going to talk about the secret to eBay. I'm going to spill the beans right here. Stay tuned. This didn't happen last year. Bearded Picker Wonderland. Look at there. Roof. We rarely get snow. So let's go inside and have Bearded Picker story time. Because <laughs> this stuff just melts on the bald head. Heat. All right. Secrets of, secrets of eBay. That's what you're here for. So, What's the beer been up to? I did some FBA today, did some retail arbitrage um, around town. And now I'm home, it's time to ship. So, Beardy Picker, what do you got to ship? We're going to ship this. All right, so the, the fellow paid, so we're going to ship both these to him. Oh, okay. We're going to ship both these to him. Someone else bought this one. And this one and I got the dinosaurs out of storage I didn't get them out yesterday so that's this is a lot of small stuff to ship so it's gonna be pretty easy so we can we can chit chat while we ship right all right so why is this one important $14 free shipping bearded picker you can't retire on that right this is the secret to eBay right here in this box so what's so special about it Absolutely nothing. It's just a regular tile, I think. What's special about it? I listed it today. The secret to eBay, folks, is wait for it. You got a list. You got a list. You got a list. So, so what am I telling you? Yesterday, I listed listed twenty five items. Yesterday, sold five of them. I'm still waiting payment on two, but that's fine. I took offers. That's amazing that that much of my inventory. Um, brand new listings. There is a new listing bump uh, insert, so you'll be seen uh, over others for a short period of time, usually 48 hours, that you get that uh, rest of all your matrix and items when they're searched. So, list, list, list. We talk about it over and over. Talk about it on shows. You know, when glitches happen, when things happen, fix the problem and get back to the listing. The worst thing you can do is stop to whine about it. List, list, list. These were both listed yesterday. Same guy bought two of them. Listed this yesterday. And listed this today. I've listed 13 so far today. So I'm going to keep going here in a few minutes. I'm just, we'll talk about the way, about, we'll talk about listing tomorrow. That'll be tomorrow's video. But today, still the secrets. Secrets to eBay. So this is going to be easy. As you can see, the light's still on. I'm still over there. All right, boxes. We need some boxes. Did I turn you off too far where you can't see the wonderful beer? It's looking rough with all that. It's making it shrink up, but all the, all the moisture. All right, so that, that's gonna go to that one. This guy here is really tough and not breakable, so he goes in uh, one of these. You go to this. Let's see. Talked about it on the show this morning. You can't lose a tape measure. So let's look at this real quick. This is a great idea here. A tape measure. Glue it down to your table. A metal one or the paper tape you can get from. So you want to know how much it is? There you go. Four and a half. It's real easy and it saves you so much time and frustration when you are not. I repeat, when you're not looking for a tape measure. Let's see how long it can take me to find a tape measure. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got like 10 of them. This is, aha, it was right behind me. Frustrating, right? All right, so we got you there, we got you there. You're six and a half inches, so you're gonna, this thing can't be hurt either. We're gonna send it in this. And those guys there, I'm almost, 
before I go switch boxes, is, 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 sometimes you need to know the weight. The weight will determine what kind of box. I think I think they're going to go over a pound, which is going to send them priority. They're 14 ounces now. I don't have a two ounce box, so uh, that that helps with that. How big is this sucker? Six. It's not even six inch. So I can get away with a six by six on that. Guy. I believe this is a six by six by four. A lot of times, but I hide this part from y'all. <laughs> That's why, because every now and then you pick the wrong box. All right, so that one. I had some six by six. So we're just gonna put it in one of these. It'll fit in a better yet. We're. It was only a ten dollar item. We're just gonna put it in a bottom energy. All right. Was that a was that a great decision or what? Better yet, we will. I put it in a poly mailer and it fits pretty good. So we will put bubble wrap around it. How's that? And notice when I said bubble wrap, I didn't say a a priority mailer or any of that crazy mess. Uh, for those of you, and I'm not accusing anybody. If you do that kind of stuff understand that that's going to get us all what we don't have free shipping supplies anymore for priority because you are not using it correctly all right crush this thing in here so do you guys do you have a listing goal so how do you know when listing is too long so we're going to cut that off it's a good thing we found Joni's scissors in the drawer, right? Don't tell her. She won't watch this video. This is, I think this is why I wasn't using them. Oh, they're terrible. All right, when all else fails, use the Scotty Peeler, right? You use the Scotty Peeler. These things are they're in the links below if you don't use these things. Band-Aids. <laughs> you better have a band-aid that's all i got to say so now this has got bubble wrap around it and the bubble wrap of the mailer it'll be fine oops change the mode on the dink i meant to hit tear all right so we got five ounces or hp on it the tile here this is an easy one or fold it over i always want to use i always try to fold it over if i can i think i've talked about it before it really give some extra well at least one of the sides got some extra cushion on it even if it, it doesn't really need it but <sighs> six ounces six ounces of tile man we are shipping like we're shipping like mad today aren't we this time we have actually found are you going sideways come on get in there Come on, baby. So I stopped by the store today. I'm gonna make chili. It's nice and cold. We don't generally get this cold and it'll be back in the 60s by Sunday. So yeah, we're gonna uh, I'm gonna make some chili. It's one of the few things I cook. I cook chili around here and I cook the spaghetti right here. Other than that, that's about it. The dinosaurs. Five ounces. Dino. Man, we are making short work, short work. It's almost like I've done this before. Y'all yeah, know I love the, the paper tape machine, but since this is sitting right here, it's easy to grab. Let's go ahead and use it. Um, Y'all want to look at that paper tape dispenser? I'll put a link to it so you can look at the specs and look how much they are. They're a little on the expensive side, but when you ship a lot, you save yourself some time and all that fun stuff. You just click on click on the link and it'll show you all about it. Let's get some bubble wrap. And if y'all don't know where I'm grabbing bubble wrap from, I got that from a Uline. It holds uh it'll hold up to four rolls. The filing cabinet blocks one of the rolls there, but 
Generally, I just use this side, and that's just just holding it up. I'll move it over here when I go to use it. But man, I love the bubble wrap holder. I used to have small bubble on one side, big bubble on the other, but I went to using all big bubble now. So. All right, that wasn't enough. So we got that, we put that in there, we put that in there. All set. How much do you weigh? 10 ounces. So no problem. Come on, cooperate. Y'all can't see the tape, being ornery. Put one more piece of pill in there just I don't know. Kicks and giggles. This is 10 ounces. And it is a GBA. So this one over here is these two. Ooh. So I took an offer on these, but you know the guy made an offer on two of them. So I took his offer, but because my price is already the lowest, I told the guy I wouldn't reduce the shipping. So just if you're doing things, think ahead, you know, think first thing he's going to do is tell me to reduce shipping. And then once I've taken, you know, $7 off each one of these, that's $14. And then he's going to want me to take another, the price of shipping kind of builds in on this listing. Anyway, I built in some of the profit into the shipping. Um, so you take advantage of when you, when you send a counter offer, if you want some conditions put in there, talk about, let them know up front that I wasn't going to come out shipping and he was already bought. So there we go. All right. I wonder if it'll fit in this joker. Try to use all different kind of boxes for y'all. Heck yeah. So this right here, y'all recognize it? It's a small flat rate. As I know, uh, people, people ask me a lot in, in comments and I love to answer questions in the comments. Um, you know, why didn't you use this? Why didn't you use that? Just so they can get some understanding of what I'm doing and what they're doing. So that's doesn't need the tape, but I'm gonna put the tape on these corners right here real quick so that <laughs> so that I can do some bubble wrap. And we are to a new roll of bubble wrap. So that's that's always sad, the death of a bubble a bubble wrap. You know, you gotta spend more money, right? When you cheat, when you cheat, you just cheat, right? Yeah, can't help it. All right. So can't. <laughs> so here we go. We got some bubble wrap. Put these guys in there. Put a piece of bubble wrap again. All right, so the bubble wrap is probably not the greatest thing for this one. Don't be afraid to admit there's probably a better plan. The bubble wrap didn't uh, didn't allow me to cover them up and didn't allow space for the, the two chargers because they've got to also get in here. Remember these things fold flat? This one. This is this is why I don't generally use this box a lot, just because it's a pain when it comes to to dealing with it. Can it stand up like that? No. It's going in there. Whether it likes it or not, right now it really doesn't like it. So they don't bang against each other, right? All right. I think we've got a winner this time. Winner, winner, chicken dinner, right? Is that the old saying? So, you're wondering, bigger picture, how much did you say? You sold those five items, what was it worth it? 
I sold five hundred and twenty-three dollars yesterday on eBay. I know you're all thinking, man, Bearded Picker is an Amazon seller. Bearded Picker is an opportunity seller. Right now, um, Amazon has said don't ship us anymore. Right now, all of our employees are going to be shipping out, and so we're not going to be receiving. So, where can you ship? Merchant Fulfill or or eBay? So that's why I'm doing eBay right now. Because you're past the, the past the time, and Amazon has asked that we, uh, they kind of said it forcefully, and I didn't, they don't really do a lot of asking. So don't be afraid to change your mind. Yeah. All right. So the secret, the secret, the secret. Make sure that you are are listing. The one thing I can tell you is eBay loves that you work through stuff. So if you're gonna list 20 items, you're better off listing them. You know four items five times in five days and you and list them all 20 and then do nothing for the next four because they reward you for activity it's bit you see stuff happen in your account uh, so it's it's amazing the difference try me on that one if you don't believe me try me on that one um i can i can point you to so many people who would agree with me uh all right so no pa no paper tape today but i'm showing you to show you the dispenser if you want to go check it out uh, they are a little on the pricey side, but the secret. Feel free to spread it around. That's an easy one, right? Merry Christmas. Beer to pick her out. Roll Tide. Due to YouTuber, appreciate each and every one of you. Like, comment, subscribe, share, all that fun stuff uh, that we creators beg you to do. Thanks. See you in the next video. You get a double Roll Tide. Beer to pick her out.